Hello everyone, Neon Jigglypuff here, and welcome back to another opinion-based video. I haven't uploaded in quite a while, so I thought this would be a great way to finally jump back into YouTube after such a long break. So sit back, get a snack, and enjoy this video, and get your keyboard out because you're probably going to be pretty mad after this video, because this video is my real controversial and unpopular Nintendo-based opinions. So without further ado, ahem. In my opinion, both New Super Mario Bros. DS and New Super Mario Bros. U are better games than Super Mario World. Paper Mario Thousand Year Door is honestly overrated. It's a great game, don't get me wrong, but it's not as great as people make it out to be. And I don't think it deserves a remake. If anything, it should get a port. And just a port. Fun fact, Paper Mario is actually made by the same company that makes Fire Emblem. And speaking of Fire Emblem, I don't like the gameplay or the characters, and I don't understand the appeal. Like, all the characters are just blue-haired, sword-wielding, shield-wielding, magic-wielding, horse-riding, booby girls. And that's pretty much all it is. So the fact that Pokemon Sword and Shield don't have every single Pokemon is not a big deal. I mean... So what? I can't catch a Tangela. It's not gonna hurt anybody. I think people are just mad about the graphics, which... Pokemon games were never brought to graphics. You guys just need to stop whining. F-Zero's hard. I mean, it's really hard. I like challenge, but when a game is that hard, it's not even fun anymore. In fact, it's just annoying. I love Smash Ultimate, but the fact that every DLC character in the Fighters Pass has been third party is really underwhelming and it takes away the real joy of having a new third party character. Now it's just expected and it's honestly really underwhelming and not fun anymore. Waluigi for Smash! I don't like the way Wario is portrayed in WarioWare. It's really dumb, like all he really is is fart humor now. I miss the old Macho Wario. Bring him back. I'm honestly so sick of WarioWare. Bring back Wario Land and put Waluigi in a Wario game for heaven's sake. Mario Golf is lame. Pokemon Snap sucks. I don't get the appeal of it at all. Fire Emblem Three Houses cutscenes just drag on and on and on, and it's hard to get attached to all these generic anime characters when they speak in two hour long text boxes. Mario Party Advance is honestly a really good game. It's unique and original, and I honestly don't get all the hate that it receives. Mother 1 slash Earthbound Beginnings has aged really poorly. The fact that I'm forced to stop and grind in every new area is really, really annoying. Breath of the Wild is cool and all, but I'm really not liking this whole open world thing when it comes to Zelda games. And the lack of music really sucks too, I mean, there's like, what, 10 songs in the entire game? And while we're on the topic of that, Link's Awakening, Skyward Sword, and Majora's Mask are all better games than Breath of the Wild. Navi is not only helpful, but she's pretty awesome too. I mean, she's the one who gave Link the courage to go out and save Hyrule. And while we're on the topic of Navi, I don't think she's that annoying. As well as Fi. Sure, she talks about your Wiimote batteries, but every Wii game did that. You guys are gonna hate me for this. Midna is super overrated, and honestly, I think she's more annoying than Fi and Navi put together. I think some of you guys just like her because she's edgy and... Thick? That's really weird. Are some of you guys seriously boycotting Little Town Hero because of the stupid national decks? You Pokemon fans need to move on and stop whining. Sans is in Smash Brothers whether you like it or not. Paper Mario 64 is better than Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Fight me! So wanting Skull Kid or Alucard or Springman or Shadow in Smash is fine, but the second someone talks about Waluigi, we're the annoying ones? You Waluigi haters are super annoying. Just let us love our purple bad boy. And speaking of that, Waluigi isn't even playable in Super Mario 64 DS. But despite that, it's still a much, much better game than the original Mario 64. So going back to the topic of Smash Brothers, I think that Terry should have been the Mii costume and Sans should have been the actual playable character. On a side note though, I'm still really grateful to have Sans in Smash Brothers. I honestly love the experience share in recent Pokemon games. It takes away grinding, and grinding is a chore and stops the pacing of the game. Minecraft Steve! 
isn't even spirit worthy. Steve does not belong in Smash. However, Jonesy from Fortnite would actually make for a pretty interesting character in Smash Brothers. I actually prefer Mario 2 over Mario 3. Princess Peach has gone stale. Do we really need her in Mario games anymore? Maybe it's time she gets the daisy treatment. Now finally, it's here for you. It's the last opinion of my video. Now you may have heard that Earthbound is dying, but honestly, the series is horrifying. Mother 1 is bland. I never played Earthbound, and Mother 3 is actually pretty good. But Undertale is better! But Undertale is better! No, I'm not kidding, I like Undertale more. CONGRATULATIONS! You've made it to the end of the video! You deserve a pat on the back. Now, a lot of you are probably, understandably, pretty mad. But here's your chance to get your revenge out on me. So what I want you guys to do in the comments is comment any controversial opinion you have, and maybe it might even trigger me. Like, if you guys didn't know, I'm a huge fan of Waluigi and Jigglypuff. So I'm giving you free range here. Try your best to trigger me in the comments. If you succeed, I will leave a simple, angry face as a response. But if you fail to trigger me, I will simply leave, I respect your opinion. But all of that aside, I really do hope that you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you found it entertaining. And I'm sorry if I triggered you guys again. These are my real opinions. I didn't make it to attack any of you specifically. If you like or don't like any of the things that I don't like or like, I'm not attacking you. It's perfectly fine. Like, if you're a fan of Peach, it's fine. If you don't like Sword and Shield, it's fine. I'm not attacking any of you. And you are all entitled to your opinions even if they're wrong. Okay, I'm joking about that. But seriously, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed, and it's good to be back making videos again. And I don't want to drag it on too long, so, um, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. And again, don't forget to like and subscribe for more. See you later, guys, and I hope you have a great day.